Hi guys, Izzy here. Welcome back to my channel. Um, let me sit down for a second. So, I'm gonna talk a little bit about this quarantine and how, honestly, I've been really, really bored. I know a lot of people are actually bored. I'm about to go for a walk and thought I should just, you know, take a couple of things. So, I wanted to show you guys how quarantine is in Toronto. So, I've been recording stuff throughout this whole month because it started on the 15 or 16 in March um, I've been recording just here and there when I go biking when I go walking I don't run it's not for me um, yes yeah, so I've been recording my surroundings how people are behaving how people um, are dealing with this they're biking running sometimes don't even wear gloves sometimes don't even wear masks they're just chilling on the grass playing with their dogs especially when it's sunny out everybody's out um, I did hear that uh, there are actually um, cops going around uh, giving ticket to people if they ca if they catch you or if they stop you and they ID you and they realize that you guys are not related and you guys don't live together there's a possibility that you will get a five thousand dollar ticket I know someone who got it I don't know them someone that I know knows them and they told me about it every day at 7 30 everybody comes on their balcony and Keep in mind, I don't have social media. I deactivated my Instagram. I'll explain that another time. But I deactivated my Instagram about almost, almost one, two, almost two, actually two months ago. And I don't have social media. So I heard from somebody else that there is this thing going around where at 7.30 you go on your balconies and you make noise or some sort of noise or I don't know if it's to support people or to um, just say that, hey, we're all in this together. But every day at 7.30, everyone comes on their balcony and they make, um, I don't know, they bring their pots and pans and start banging on it. And it's, it's actually kind of cool. I find it pretty cute. I find it really cool. Do you guys hear this? So every day at 7.30, people come to their balconies and they make some noise. I should have read more about it. I don't know why, but they do. The noise is coming from like all the way that way too. And I'm not sure if you guys can really hear it in the camera, but. person right there. The what? Yes. Every day might get louder, but when it's someone's gonna die then, who's gonna get tired of coming on their balcony at 7.30? Some people are on their balcony, just like literally standing there and staring. <laughs> I've been hanging out with my sister a lot. That's one thing that came out of this because me and her have been at home for this whole time, which is really good. Um, you kind of go insane and crazy when you're at home for this long. So me and her have been just been doing stupid things to each other and just laughing at the dumbest shit ever. And it's honestly, it's fun. I love it. I'm actually creating a whole different kind of bond side with my sister. I had this bond side, bond side. I, ha I had the side to our um, to friendship, to our relationship between me and my sister but I feel like it got even to more of an extreme of fucking dumb things that is just honestly amazing, I love it we just, I love my sister and I'm very glad the friendship, it was, it was close but it got even closer due, due to the way we've been making each other laugh and spending time with each other 
Um, yeah, I'm not gonna blog about that. That's just, yeah. Anyways, currently everything in Toronto is closed. Everything that's open is grocery stores, gas stations, um, subway, buses, us are running. Um, Uber Eats, um, skip the dishes because actually there are a lot of people ordering, which is crazy. But it's, I'm not surprised because scientifically proven, when you stay home for two weeks or more than two weeks, or you know not not really staying home but not being active in terms of like exercising your body just you you actually start to automatically crave junk food which is which makes sense why a lot of people are ordering every video you see they're not all from one day they're all from separate days so i record it all so i can show you guys um, i will be recording more i have some other things that i want to experience during this quarantine just curious about how people are behaving um, i will be showing you guys more videos uh, but for now, uh, I will be posting this one for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy it. This is the line for LCBO. It goes from there and it continues all the way at the end there. This is so freaking funny. It's a Friday too, that's why.
finally I am at the other side of Toronto. As you can see, CN Tower is like all the way, the way. Taking a walk, trying something a different, well, trying a different path. As you can see, everyone's in the park. Um, not everyone's wearing mask or gloves. You would see most people wearing gloves but not mask. Um, and some of them just don't wear neither of them. I mean neither, so yeah. As we're walking, the cops have finally arrived and they're asking everyone, whoever is sitting down, to get up and they're not allowed to sit down in one place. Everyone has to be active, walking and not gathering in one place. We think we're done our walk or we're walking back. I hope you guys are staying safe, staying at home staying sane and if you're someone who needs to stay active um, just go exercise by yourself don't invite your friends don't invite anybody just go do your own thing and get back shower often um, have hot liquids uh, wash your hands and sanitize and just take care of yourself because it's not worth it um, yeah and this is temporary guys so please just suck it up because it's not permanent temporary uh yeah that's pretty much about it um nothing much really my hands are freezing so i think i'm gonna put the camera down because yeah my hand is really cold i will see you guys in the next video and i will have more videos for you guys of the quarantine diary i guess that's happening in toronto for, for you guys so yeah that's pretty much it i'm gonna go for a walk because i'm really bored and i did my assignment that i was supposed to so yeah, um, bye.